And so we're looking at the first lesson here of verbal reasoning, 11 plus. Let's have a look at the first question. So let's just read this question through with me together. Select the one letter that will complete the word in front of the brackets and begin the word after the brackets. The same letter must fit into both sets of brackets to make four new words. Okay, let's have a go at this and I'll show you exactly how to answer this particular question. So we're looking at uh, one letter here and exactly the same letter that will fit in the top. So we've got two similar letters, same letters at the top and the bottom. And in this case, we'll make four brand new words. So let's have a look at this. So we've got four options here. We have A, T, C, and S. So let's try the first one, A. So if you were to put the A in the top and the bottom, what will that give us? That will not really give us four words, to be honest. Let's try the second one, T. Let's put T in the top and the bottom, and let's see if this works. So if you put the T in the top and the bottom, the first word will be blast. Okay, that's good. The second word will be treason. That makes sense. The third word will be short. Yes. And the fourth word will be trip. Okay. So that gives us four brand new words. And just to be sure, you can have a look at the last two options, C and S, just to make sure if that works or not. Okay. So let's, in this case, go for um, T, because T will be the correct answer. And let's move on to the next question. Exactly the same thing. So we're looking at the same letters in the top and the bottom to make four brand new words. So let's try the first option here. We have G. So let's try G first of all. Is that going to help us in this case? So slug is the first one. That makes sense. Gentle will be the second word. Third word will be bag. And the fourth word will be girl. So as you can see, we've now created four brand new words by just using one letter, the same letter, on the top and the bottom. Okay, so have a go at the rest of the questions in the test and go exactly through the same questions using the same theoretical knowledge that we've just applied together. Okay, thank you.